So this is my pouring area, all staged up. You can see over here on the far right, that's a bucket of water for quenching the casting after I demold. Flask is sitting right there. Um, that tree sitting in front of it's just what I put this phone in, so I've got something to hold the phone to do the video with. Then here's my rig. I have the Battlestar Galactica here, but uh, as far as what's staged over here, about the sun, you can see my pouring shank there, open ring shank with gloves, and then the uh, overhead crane there, really I just use it to hang my utensils on, that's a contact pyrometer so I can measure the molten metal temperature. The thing on the right is my degassing lance. Those things just insert there into that plug. And then as far as the uh, controls go, see if we can get a picture of what's going on here. Yeah, it's going to strobe so you probably aren't going to be able to read it because of the frequency there. But it shows me what the power status is. It'll, it'll record energy, voltage, and current. You probably can't read it because I can't see it. It's strobing across, but it's uh, in the vicinity of 8 kW, 240 volts, 32 amps. And then here, same thing, it's strobing, but hopefully you can see it's strobing. Right now it says the furnace temperature is 1688. It's set on 1800. And that is hard to read too, but that shows it's 33 degrees Fahrenheit out because that's my barometer hanging on, on the tree over there. But when I insert that um, in the furnace, I get a reading on the metal temperature. The rest of it's just bells and whistles. Um, the button on the right there, this one, allows me to turn off all the uh, furnace coils so I don't electrocute myself <laughs> when I reach in there. The rest of them just hour meters and these are the status lamps. This tells you if power is actively being applied uh, to, the, uh, to the coils or not. And this shuts down everything if there's a panic. And then this little circuit up here is just the DC voltage circuit for controlling the actuator um, up and down uh, on the furnace. So when you see me fiddling around with everything, that's what's going on. So I'll get, uh, get everything set up here, get the phone on that tree. And uh, I think what I want to do is show a close-up picture or close-up video of the pour into the well. So. You won't actually see me snatch it from there, um, but uh, yeah, I want to see what's going on in this uh, offset pouring well, so that's what I'm going to set up. Alright, next one should be the actual pour taking place. 